Today I'll be sharing with you how I examine the stationarity in the SPSS through the help from R. So recently I was learning about the time series analysis and I came across this ADF test and KPSS test for stationarity checking. In SPSS, these two functions were not readily available. However, I found out that by using R, we can use the T-series package in SPSS to run the ADF and KPSS test. The other YouTube video I refer to uh, is using this stationarity and core integration test. When I check my SPSS, I don't have this button. Then I go and do some research and find out we can have this function by installing the T-series package in R and use the R extension in our SPSS. But it's not an easy task even though I follow the steps from other YouTube channel. Their situations were not the same as mine. I was having a hard time installing the packages and debugging the T-series installation. My SPSS can't load the package. Therefore, I hope this video can help ease your process if you are in the same situation like me. From my experience, I learned that in order to use the T-series in R, you need to have other supporting packages. I had list out the things uh, need to be done and the packages needed to be downloaded. You also need the correct R tools, uh, which is compatible to your SPSS version. My SPSS version is 27, therefore R 3.6 is the one suitable for my case. Once you have downloaded the package, you can start the installation process. In order for the SPSS to run the package, you need to bridge the SPSS and R manually. To do that, you need to get the R configuration in SPSS extension hub. Click the extension hub. I had already pre installed the R3.6 configuration for my SPSS, so let's scroll down and look for it. So my version is uh, 1.0.2. You can install the configuration you need or suitable for your system under the Explore tab. Now let us look at the prerequisite for this uh, configuration. As you can see here, this configuration requires SPSS version 27. Now let us go and install our packages and other tools. I'm downloading this R2 35 compatible to my R3.6 suitable for my SPSS 27. Next, we need to download the packages. First one is Quad Pro, Zoo, XTX, Curl, TTR, and last but not least, our T series. It is important to know where you downloaded your packages. Later on, it will be easy for you to just copy the file path. Now for the installation part, open your R. Highlight this code and press Ctrl C to copy. Paste the code in the R console. Then we need to change the file path. Then press enter to initiate the installations. You need to repeat the coding individually for each package. After the installation, now we can run the stationary testing under Analyze, Forecasting and Stationary Tests. Choose the appropriate variable and then check for ADF and KPSS. Use the correct setting. then voila you will have your result here so that's all from me i hope this video can help you with your installation process see you